Hi everyone, today we're going to be learning about Senecio vulgaris L, otherwise known as Common Ragwort, Old Man of the Spring, and Common Groundsel. Common Groundsel is a herbaceous annual plant that grows to be about 15 to 30 centimeters tall and has a very short life cycle. It can grow from a seed to a mature plant in just five weeks. Additionally, this species can cause liver damage in cattle if they're allowed to eat it. Now, if we take a look at a distribution map of common groundsel in North America, we can see that it's not native anywhere on this map, yet it is present in most places and is noxious in a few others. This species is actually native to Europe, North Africa, and Asia. It's thought that it arrived in North America through European settlers that brought grain over. Now, you shouldn't be planting this species, but if you're looking for it for other purposes, it grows best in hardiness zones 5 through 9. Alright, as far as common groundsel's natural environment goes, it prefers disturbed, moist, sunny areas. Some habitats this species can be found in include roadsides, in lawns, or along sidewalks. Now when it comes to the stem of common groundsel, it is hollow and the leaves are attached in an alternating pattern. The leaves themselves are green, rough, lobed, slightly pubescent, and serrate. Additionally, the leaves at the base of the plant grow from a short petiole, whereas the leaves at the top of the plant attach directly to the stem, so they are sessile. Common groundsel blooms February to May, and when it does, it produces an inflorescence that contains many small yellow flower heads. These flower heads contain only disc flowers. There are no ray flowers which we would perceive as petals. Each yellow flower head is surrounded by an involucre, which are a set of green bracts that have a black tip. These flowers are perfect, so they can fertilize themselves. However, they are typically pollinated by a variety of different insects. After pollination takes place, many akines with white papyrus will form. A single common groundsel plant can reproduce multiple times per year, producing anywhere from 1,700 to 1 million seeds. The flowers of plants that have been uprooted can even still go to seed. Luckily, the plant can only reproduce by seed. It cannot do so vegetatively. However, the seeds are wind dispersed, so they can go decently far. Alrighty, thank you all for watching. I hope that you enjoyed learning about common groundsel, otherwise known as Senecio vulgaris with me. If you did, be sure to like and subscribe, and I hope to see you all in my next video.